Welcome to this video against Heroku. Um, French defense. I play a main variation. C5. This is not so common. I can take on D5, I think. And he has a pawn structure where I can maybe put some pressure on D5. So now I'm also threatening to take on c5 and then the d5 pawn is weak. Here I just attack the defender of the d5 pawn. So ha. Huh. The thing is if I take in t takes here and I take on c5 then he might play knight c3. Hmm. Maybe I try to develop quick. Can I take now? I think I'd rather castle. And the next move is to take. Now I want to do this. We play both pretty quick. Um, should take some more time in this uh, in this game. So now the the d5 pawn is hanging. He needs to react. And after d4, I play knight e4, taking his. Bishop on f6. I think this is a bit passive. I like to attack him somehow. Hmm. Maybe queen d2 to protect the the knight on c3 that I can play maybe a3 and b4. I want to bring over the other rook here, of course. Put even more pressure on the d5 pawn with rook d1. And I thought after bishop g4 I can take and then play knight e4 maybe. The question is if I really want to allow that so huh I can take on d5 he can win the, the b2 pawn later on so he takes I take bishop b2 I have rook b1, maybe I can take here. So where do I want to put the, the rook? Do I want to play rook e1 or I think I just do this. So the material is that I'm a pawn up, but the pawn is not the nicest uh, pawn on the on the planet. So the c5 pawn is a bit weak also. Mm. I like to attack him somehow, but well. I wanted to go to h5 anyways, so now if we can play g5, knight g5 I mean. h6 I play knight e4. 
and then maybe I have uh, bishop d3 also. Mm. I play way too way too quick. It's a it's a rapid game, so we have some time. Can I play <coughs> Bishop D three there later on? Or I play something like H four? Hmm. Doesn't work at the moment, but let's put the bishop on D three. This looks good. I wanted to play bishop e f <laughs> knight e4 first, so totally nonsense what I did. Terrible. What, why? How can you play something like this? Just blundering a piece. Oh my god. So... At least he played bishop f6 here yeah but he, he does the right thing just to just to give the exchange so hmm I'm terrible shape hmm I don't know if this was really necessary. But maybe. I think the mistake was bishop f6. He shouldn't have played bishop f6. Bishop e7 and everything would be fine. Okay, I, I, I tried to trick him. If he takes, I have queen e4. Forking bishop and knight. And otherwise I play d5, d6. Maybe I have rook e4 and rook f4 also. So this game is interesting now. He has a slight material advantage. But I have some pressure. Okay, I thought... Queen e4 is winning. Hmm. Well, he played this very quick. Do I have rook c1? There is no discovery attack here no bad one although knight c2 maybe he could have played knight c2 yeah this is hopeless I think so although he has so many pawns hmm but I get, get the seventh rank so Let's do this, and then I enter on e7. The knight doesn't have support, like a, maybe he wants to go to c4 somehow. Knight e6. Hmm. So knight e7 next, and the pawn on a7 might uh, also be loose. But after knight d6, I play rook d7 first. Then he needs to, to, to move the knight again. And then I enter on e7. So material you can also see here. So 
So the idea is uh, rook d7, because otherwise rook e7 he has maybe also rook d8. But here I attack the knight, and then I play rook e7, forcing him to play rook f8, and then I grab the pawn here. So the, the rook on a8 is very passive, and maybe the rook stays passive. Wow. But this is losing, right? Because... Hmm. So the, he can't move his knight any uh, some somewhere because then the g7 pawn is hanging. Let's check. If I go to b7, rook d8, I have this intermediate move here. I take place a3, I go rook a7. So now the situation changed a bit, so I'm material up a little bit, but I think this is uh, hardly to win here. So I like still to freeze uh, his pieces. Maybe I can, in some good day, enter with my king here somehow, but I don't see it. Rook h5 next. I don't know how to enter there. Okay, let's try. Let's try this. I threaten rook f4, winning the, the knight because king is 7 king e4, and the knight is gone. And if he goes to g8, I also can pick up the knight. So I think he needs to play rook e5 now. Hmm, can I win this game, I wonder? Okay, he just blundered. Now I can win the game. Thanks for watching.